Welcome to News World Today. To get more news please subscribe Thy's channel Top Democrat Steps Down in Disgrace, He Deserves This. One of the top liberal politicians in this country has been forced to resign from his position in light of recent allegations of sexual misconduct. Rep. John Conyers, Demi, announced Sunday that he is stepping down from his position on the House Judiciary Committee, according to the Daily Caller. The congressman had faced considerable pressure from his colleagues in the House to resign in the wake of various sexual harassment allegations. A. After careful consideration and in light of the attention drawn by recent allegations made against me, I have notified the Democratic leader of my request to step aside as ranking member of the House Judiciary Committee during the investigation of these matters. A Congressman Conyers said in an official statement as well as on Twitter. Despite the severity and number of many of the sexual harassment accusations, the Democrat expressed reluctance to step down from his role while still denying all allegations made against him. A To be clear, I would like very much to remain as ranking member, A Rep. Conyers said in a statement. A. There is still much work to be done on core concerns like securing civil rights, enacting meaningful criminal justice reform, and protecting access to the ballot box. A. At the same time, Mr. Conyers went on to suggest that fighting for important issues, such as civil rights and voting protections, has become all the more critical under President Trump's administration. These challenges could not be more pressing in the face of an administration that cares little for the rule of law and a president whose actions and conduct cheapens our discourse every day, a he tweeted. Recent documents obtained by BuzzFeed reported that Mr. Conyer A.S. repeatedly made sexual advances to his female staff, as well as requests which included sex acts, touching women inappropriately in public and supposedly using taxpayer funding to contact and transport his various love affairs. Conyers strongly postulated that the performing of personal service or favors would be looked upon favorably and lead to salary increases or promotions, A said one former employee in the documents, who alleged that the Democrat told her to just cuddle up with me and caress me before you go. A. Another added that one of my duties while working for Rep. Conyers was to keep a list of women that I assumed he was having affairs with and call them at his request and, if necessary, had them flown in using congressional resources. A even one male employee witnessed Mr. Conyers rubbing the legs and body of a lady in a what appeared to be a sexual manner. A. An anonymous source revealed that Congress manages to keep these sexual harassment allegations secret by slowing down the process to such a grinding pace where victims feel like they have no other option but wait for an eventual settlement. Rep. John Conyers has stepped down as the ranking Democrat on the House Judiciary Committee. Should Mr. Conyers be removed from all leadership positions? I was basically blackballed, A said one source, who felt like she had nowhere to go before accepting a $27,000 settlement in exchange for a confidentiality agreement. The Washington Post reports that the Congress A Office of Compliance paid out $17 million for 264 settlement cases with federal employees many of them signing confidentiality agreements and never reaching the line of day. Hopefully, a thorough investigation of Mr. Conyers' actions will be undertaken soon to get to the bottom of these accusations.